Harriet Martineau was a key figure in early American society, where she made a strong case against tariffs, arguing that they favored the rich and had detrimental effects on the working class in both the United States and Britain. She was an advocate for the Whig Poor Law reforms, which sought to change the way assistance was provided to the poor in Britain, shifting from cash donations to the workhouse model. Martineau's viewpoints on these economic and social issues brought attention to the inequalities and injustices present in the early American and British societies. Martineau argued that tariffs mainly benefited the wealthy by protecting domestic industries and increasing their profits. However, she pointed out that these tariffs led to higher prices for consumer goods, which disproportionately affected the working classes. In her view, the working classes had to bear the burden of the tariffs through increased living expenses, while the wealthy enjoyed the advantages of protected industries. Furthermore, Martineau believed that the Whig poor law reforms were necessary to address the issues of poverty in Britain. She argued that the existing system of providing cash donations to the poor was unsustainable and even harmful, as it created dependency and discouraged self-sufficiency. The workhouse model, according to Martineau, offered a more structured and disciplined approach to assisting the poor, aiming to uplift them through labor and moral guidance. Martineau's perspectives on economic and social issues were groundbreaking in her time, as she fearlessly challenged the status quo and advocated for reforms that aimed to address the inequalities and injustices within society. Her arguments against tariffs and in support of the Whig poor law reforms reflected her commitment to social justice and her unwavering determination to speak up for the marginalized and disadvantaged. Thank you.